Hey everybody, David and David here from payitforward.com and upphone.com. And in this video, we're going to tell you about the best WordPress themes of 2020. Let's just cut to the chase. They're made by StudioPress. StudioPress was recently purchased by WP Engine, which is hands down the best WordPress hosting company out there. So one of the best parts about this is that you'll get the same great support from StudioPress's team as WP Engine, same company, same support team. So a lot of the times you can't figure out where a problem is actually happening. It'll be with the web hosting provider like GoDaddy and then they're like, go talk to your theme company. This makes it a lot easier. Yep, with the WP Engine hosting plan, all the Studio Press themes are included for free. Mm -hmm. And you could buy them one off and use them wherever you want to. One of my favorite parts of Studio Press themes is that they're very clean in terms of code. You don't have to be a coder to use these themes. Actually, they're very simple mm -hmm. to use compared to a lot of the other ones that we've tried. Google loves to see websites that are fast and they're clean. So we built a website recently for a graphic designer. Yep. Let's show you that real quick. This is built on Studio Press, mullinaxart.com. And this is pretty much a default theme, but I think it's really a beautiful theme and it's very, very functional. And Google loves to see stuff like this. One thing too here is that if you go to the services page, mm -hmm. we were able to import this content as like a default template and then just update the prices as we wanted them and some of the things that are included when you sign up. If you have any experience with WordPress themes at all, you know that sometimes setting up custom designs is a very convoluted process. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you have to drag in custom widgets and other times, it's, it's weird. Also, StudioPress isn't a page builder right. typically, right? Well, page builder, you know, they're slow, they're bloated as you were saying, that's bad for SEO if it makes your website slow. So like mm -hmm. Elementor, X. Uh, they, they, yeah. they just get a lot of uh, positive reviews on YouTube. We don't really recommend those though because of the negative SEO implications. Yeah, negative SEO implications <laughs> and you can never leave because page builders are full of custom shortcodes. Mm -hmm. Also, WordPress has said that they're gonna make page builders go away, which right. is unfortunate for the people that have built these page builders. Right. Well, that's kind of the long-term plan of Gutenberg mm -hmm. is to make the page builders obsolete. Yeah, exactly. It's, it's kind of a good thing for you as a website designer though, or because then you can take your content that mm -hmm. you've built and then you can change the theme, which is the whole point of having a theme is that you can keep your content and change the theme, but with the page builders, as we just said. That isn't always the case. So let's log in here with Steven. So first let's take a look at the home page. I'll just go to pages on the left and then Steven Molinax. What really sold me on Studio Press is that even though you get all these custom elements and these are atomic blocks, they all work natively within the WordPress block editor, which is amazing. Mm -hmm. So it's super easy to add paragraph content. And then for instance, this post and page grid, and we set it up so that we just had the portfolio post at the top and then just some blog posts down here. Then you can have an email opt-in form and all this works together with the WordPress regular old paragraphs and images and headings, but then also all these atomic blocks. Yeah, and if you wanna learn actually how to set up a website just like this, we made a full tutorial on how to do so. Mm -hmm. We'll link that in the card above and the description section below. Maybe we should take a few minutes to talk about the free themes you can get on WordPress. There are thousands of free themes. Mm -hmm. uh, we've, I've used them before, you've used them before. Yep. Um, we don't really recommend using them though. No, especially because I think my number one reason, which might be different than yours, is that support is not included with free themes. Support is everything in terms of themes. Studio Press is the best I've ever seen in terms of being able to see what the demo looks like and then that's actually what shows up on the website and what a relief that is. Right, that's kind of the thing. They have a really nice demo. You say, I want my website to look like that. It's impossible to do it. Right. A lot of the time when you get a free theme to get all the features of that theme, you need the pro version of the theme, which is gonna cost you money anyway. Right. Why not just get a great theme right out of the box? Yeah, if there is a pro version available of a free theme, it is not a free theme you're gonna have to buy the pro version of the theme. That's, That's a good the point. whole point. They, just, they get you in the door and then you put in a bunch of hours and then by that point, you're not gonna back out. Right. It's a good sales tactic. Yep. But Studio Press is not like that. So X, Divi with elegant themes, Page Builder stuff, yeah. Astro with Elementor. We've tried all of these different themes and Studio Press, especially coupled with WP Engine is really the best bet. Yes, we'll link to Studio Press and WP Engine in the description section below. One last thing we want to mention about Studio Press is that they have a theme regardless of your niche. If you have an e-commerce store, mm -hmm. you're going to need a different theme than a personal blog. So you can go to Studio Press and find the perfect theme for you regardless of your niche. Yep. Just check out all the demos. And for Steven's website, you'll recognize this theme, which is the Essence Pro theme package. But this is really great for people that are free. I mean, you can see how much value you're going to get by signing up for a WP Engine hosting right. plan. So that is why we like Studio Press, and that is why we think they're the best WordPress theme 
in 2020. Thank you guys for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you've enjoyed. Leave us a comment down below about your favorite themes. We'd love to talk to you about themes, maybe help you choose a theme for your website. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more great videos about WordPress.